Hey there, luxury seekers. Just picture this for a second, you've got so much money that you could buy whatever you want in the blink of an eye. Well, that's the deal for the Sultan of Brunei, one seriously loaded monarch with a net worth of about $30 billion, who's swimming in cash like you wouldn't believe. But what does he do with all that money? Well, let's see it for yourself. Just get ready to witness a kind of luxury that's gonna make your wildest dreams look tame. Alright, let's jump in. Inside the gigantic empire of Hassan al Bolkia, Sultan of Brunei. Massive car collection. The Sultan owns a gigantic car collection. He's got 7,000 fancy rides in his garage, and they're worth a mind blowing $5 billion. This collection beats all collections out there. The crown jewel of his fleet is a sick gold coated Rolls Royce with a convertible top and even a platform for umbrellas. Back in the 90s, the Bolkia fam owned over half of all Rolls-Royce cars worldwide. According to GQ, the Sultan owns a six stash of 600 Rolls-Royce rides and 300 Ferrari supercars. Ultra-luxurious real estate Hassan al Bolkia went all out when he built his palace, fit for a king. He resides in the Astana Nurul Iman Palace in Brunei, which covers a sprawling area of 200,000 square meters. This palace is valued at a whopping $1.6 billion and holds the impressive title of being the largest residential palace in the world. It was completed in 1984, and it boasts 1,700 bedrooms, 257 bathrooms, 110 garages, and 5 luxurious swimming pools. The horses even have their own air-conditioned stables to ensure they enjoy the utmost comfort. An Array of Private Jets the Sultan knows how to travel in ultimate luxury, both on the road and in the air. His collection of private jets is absolutely insane, customized to his exact needs. He's got a Boeing 767-200, an Airbus A340-200, and, to top it off, a jaw-dropping Boeing 747-400, which takes the cake. It's gold-plated and decked out with Lalique crystal and gold. They call it the Flying Palace, and it's worth nearly $400 million. Don't go ahead just yet. Let's take just a moment to sharply hit the subscribe button and then turn on notifications for our fancy channel to stay up to date with all the future content. Now, let's jump right into the Sultan's amazing art collection. Extravagant Art Collection No fancy palace is legit without some crazy expensive art, and the Sultan knows how to ball when it comes to collecting. Pierre-Auguste Renoir, a legendary artist known for pioneering the Impressionist style, created a bunch of breathtaking masterpieces during his enthusiastic and pearl period. According to SCMP, the Sultan splurged a jaw-dropping $70 million to own one of Renoir's oil paintings called Two Young Girls at the Piano. Accessories and Lessons The Sultan isn't shy about splurging big bucks on both extravagant and everyday things. According to Business Insider, he dropped a cool $7 million on a rug embroidered with gold and jewels. When it comes to sports, Bolkia is also all-in. He once shelled out $1.5 million for a badminton coach who trained him personally. But wait, there's more. He once paid undisclosed seven-figure amounts to bring in top-notch NFL players like Joe Montana and Herschel Walker to teach his son the ins and outs of football. Expensive Haircuts being a military guy with strict standards, Hassan al Bolkia never compromises on his appearance. He makes sure his grooming game is always on point. When he's out in public, he rocks a crisp coat, and he pays special attention to his hair. His go-to barber works at the swanky Dorchester Hotel in Mayfair, London. To ensure he gets the best cut, he flies the barber in first class regularly. And get this, the barber pockets a cool $20,000 in cash for each visit. Lavish Parties Sultan Bolkia knows how to party like a king. He never holds back when it comes to celebrating important moments. Back in 1996, he went all out for his 50th birthday bash, dropping a mind-blowing $27 million. This two-week extravaganza took place in Brunei and had big-shot guests like Prince Charles in attendance. But wait, that's not just it. The Sultan's daughter, Princess Fajla, tied the knot in a week-long ceremony in January 2022. According to Vanity Fair, the wedding was no joke and reportedly cost about $20 million. Thanks for tuning in. 
If you think today's video was cool, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe and notification button and give us a big fancy like. We appreciate your support, and it keeps us going. Now, let's hear it from you. What's your take on the Sultan of Brunei's gigantic empire and his insanely luxurious lifestyle? Leave your answers down below, and keep it chic. Thank you.